Hi ESL and SEI team, this is Chris Abraham from Go Academy. In this video, I want to talk about two activities that you can do before our last class to interact with the group. Let's take a look at both these activities right now, okay? Now something you can do before the final class, you're going to see in each one of these sections what I've done is I've reconfigured the comment sections and I ask a question. Who needs to go back and take a second look at the top 100 vocabulary? I want you to respond to that question. You just type in your answer, put in your feedback, put five stars because it looks good and press return. I want you to share that. And each of these sections here, they have questions. Some are easier than others. Okay, but I want you to go through and I want you to post and respond back to each of these questions in each of the sections. So this one right here, if we zoom in, it says provide a one sentence or phrase definition of the below terms, phonology, morphology, syntax, semantics, and pragmatics. I want you to go through and, at, and give a quick definition of each one of those vocab terms. There's a few more here. There's a question under second language acquisition theories oral language and oracy, um, academic language, and there's a, a question under vocabulary. This is what we've done so far. I want you to make sure that before tomorrow's class, you post comments. Look at the question, post your answer. You can find all these questions on the Go Language page. Make sure you do that before tomorrow's class, okay? All right, here's the second thing you can do. I want you to go to this section on workshops. I'm just going to go to the, I'm going to press that button that says team posters. The second thing you can do is do your team poster. And this, this gives you lots of examples of what's required for the team poster. But really it's about you just getting creative and having some fun and coming up with an inspiring team name, a team name that embraces the content of your class. So this is for a math class, right? You can see these math teachers really got into it. But you want to come up with an original name that's specific for your particular exam. And you want to make sure that it has at least five different colors, that it's over the top positive. All right. You want it to be an original name. So these are the things to put into your team poster. So team, this is a challenge. I challenge you to submit your team poster tonight. Remember, original name, five colors, over the top positive. Email it to Go Academy. And we'll share these with the team tomorrow, okay? All right. All right, team. This is Chris Abraham from Go Academy. I can't wait to read over everyone's comments and share your posters with the team. Everyone have a great day. Keep climbing up this mountain. You can do this, okay? I'll see you later, team. Bye, team. Bye-bye.